Okay, boys and gorillas, I mean girls. Look at that thing. That's a big twee. That's considerably bigger than any I have caught today so far. I just flopped quite a few big ones. Well, a few big ones with the chainsaw. Just because these big butt swells, when you put the Ryan's head, when you clamp them, it'll do this because of the butt swell. And it makes them, cut. I'd rather just cut them by hand and not have any issues. These are too valuable to tear up, but these are fun to cut by hand. <laughs> I could get it, but it would take multiple cuts and be pretty ugly. So I don't mind cutting big monstrous trees I got my hand. I don't even know how many feet's in that thing, but it is big. That is one big smoker. All right, let's see what we can do with this one. I'll see if I can prop you up on the track. You'll be good and sick of my logging videos by the end of the day. I'm actually putting some up. Oh well, whatever. I don't have time to edit and all that crap, so I just put up some small short ones. See what that'll do. Boy, that's a big tree. I'd like to be able to get it somewhere where you can watch it crash. I don't know how to do that though. I don't have any way of uh say this ain't a GoPro, this is my tablet, so I'm just trying to prop you up where it'll stay. That's a big twee. I don't know if it's gonna work or not. Not having the most abundant of luck here. Try this another way. All right, it's gonna take me a while to carve this one up. Maybe I can grab it and show it falling. Now I got a half a tank, this will be enough. Oh, this stuff like this burns gas, I can tell you that. I could try and get it to go over there and not destroy them trees right there. This place has had a lot of cold green. Oh, I don't particularly care about breaking that piece of junk because it's rotten anyway. I think I'm just going to stuff it down in there. It's probably going to want to turn on me if I don't. <laughs>
actually was gonna catch that, but I don't care, it's junk anyway. Wow, that's a big sticker. Yeah. Sorry, I didn't move very fast. I'm gonna try and get you a better shot. Oh well. That's a big stick. Yeah. Mr. Chang slays another. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. I ended up, I figured I might want to plug that center there, uh, bore it just so I didn't uh, pull anything in the center, but I don't think I needed to. Yeah, got my hinge a little thin there. That's a nice stick. That sucker's probably in the wide spot. Just about four feet. That's a big tree. I don't think that's. I don't think that's uh, pure northern red oak. I think it's a mix. I think it's got some black oak or something. So there's a lot of. Uh, supposedly there's like 57 different varieties of oak, like all different interbred crap, you know. So all right, I'm gonna trim that up. And uh, here, I'll set you back over here maybe for a second. Perhaps. Let's see what happens. Not too good at this. Here's my dirty glove, but. Some of the butt swells off it. Ugh. But there ain't got much gas left. Oh boy. That sucked down some gas over there. as I did. That was rather fun. There's some big crankers in here. I never even looked at this side of the job when I looked at it. I just told them I'd do it. As I worked my way around in here, some pretty nice stuff. The big smoker right there too. Big red oak. That's a true northern red oak. See how the bark is like wider? This one, I don't think though, this one I don't know, it might be, because the bark looks different on that side. Maybe it's just tighter on this side. But sometimes when they get big like that, they, they look more like a black oak or like a half breed, you know? I don't know. All right, oh, well, I'm gonna buck, work this stuff up and make another buggy load. I think we've gotten five buggy loads today. That's pretty good for two guys. Uh, all right, well. Ta-ta, y'all. Have a good one. Don't forget to like and subscribe.